Alright guys, welcome back. This is the Benjinator. And I am Ericode. You're watching Let's Play Final, Final Fantasy, Fantasy X. X. So the last time we came to this strange uh, shore of the moon flow, and now we're about to cross it. <coughs> and apparently Code is uh, dying of some kind of heart attack. <laughs> some horrible African disease. Oh yes. Now of course if you... What play? <laughs> Ten years. Oh wow. You ever come home and be like, wow, even after the weekend, <laughs> this place is still a dump. Yeah, pretty much. Unfortunately, uh, this giant brontosaurus cannot hit you in the face. <coughs> but, you know. I think it'd be hilarious if it crapped on him. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. No, where, so where's the, where's uh, the... Yeah, Ooh. let's, let's rise, just poof puff. Ja, you know, it's weird, we were talking about Auschwitz. Yeah, that, that probably was, uh... It was not a segue that is exactly the most of all time, but we'll take it. We gotta take it. <coughs> so bitch. It sounds like the name of a band. Really weird band. Yeah. Like what they good music though? Yeah, like I feel like it would be like a hipster band with like an accordion and a glockenspiel. I don't know. It sounds <laughs> like it'd be more hardcore. I guess, yeah. Lots of beards, yeah. Band, you know? mm -hmm. hey, hey. <coughs> look, look. What? Well, I well, thought they were. We don't do what you tell us to do. I thought they were about to play Never Have I Ever. <laughs> that would be funny. I mean, I mean, you have to imagine they must get bored <laughs> on these like, scripts every once in a while. Never have I ever been an adult My and not stoned. <laughs> <laughs> Which is a yay lesson of hubris. That seems to be a common theme in this game. Yeah, that's the lesson. <laughs> or you got to get better engineers. <laughs> Waka is that old uncle. Yeah, <laughs> you know the one that like. He never outright says he doesn't like Jewish people, but you <laughs> think he does, and yeah. he doesn't believe in evolution, mm -hmm. and he'll tell you why we didn't come from monkeys, and when you try to explain to him that that's not what evolution means, <laughs> he doesn't want to listen to it. Pretty much. Waka will be a wonderful uncle. It uses a Ouija board for that. <laughs> Oh, the the giant lightning bolt <laughs> kind. Well, yeah. that, that clears it all up then. Of course. Where are your cars and planes? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I have to give Titus some credit. He he does have somewhat of a bullshit detector. Yeah. That he is using every once in a while. <laughs> they could. We did. Mm -hmm. These people don't really believe in contractions, do they? <laughs> Which may we not use? The war did not stop. <laughs> Annunciation. We. For people who hate machines, they seem to be impersonating data quite a bit. Yeah. <laughs> you can't. Don't even try. Anybody who gets that, you're awesome. Oh, I'm pretty sure our viewers will get it. All four of you. Yes, yeah, all four of you. We love you. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. That's the disaster of music. Sit down. Sit down. Orin's got... Oh, shit! How many times are they gonna fucking do that? No. She's like Jordy fucking LaForge. How many times are you going... That's another Star Trek reference. <laughs> are you going to get... Captured. Aye, aye, aye. And that thing looks like a, an infected starfish. Starfish with the worst case of herpes ever. Oh, yeah. It's a Machina thing. Whee. Okay, well. I'm trying to remember what, exactly what to do against See, this dude. If Yuna were smart, she'd just start summoning, like, right now. Yeah, you just have... If we're, like... Come in there and be like, all right, all maybe, right. Maybe not Ifrit because like the water would all start to boil. Mm -hmm. But 
Oh yeah. Oh, it's this thing again. Oh, that is brutal. All it's right. balls of doom. The silence. Silence. Does silence work on a machine? Uh, you know, I I don't think it does. Yeah. <laughs> that I I I. I some damage it was the shits and giggles thing. <laughs> Oh, well, this thing seems to be counterattacking a lot, so... I don't think that's a direct counterattack, but it is something. Alright, let's 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 see if he can do something special. Okay, aim, which is mostly useless, but we'll use it anyway. So it looks like we're, you know, even with a variety. Actually, here's one thing that would be useful, is Hast. Haste. Wee! I, I can swim faster! I do love me some haste. Oh, wow, it's going up. Uh-uh. You know, maybe we should just continue to not attack it. See if we can get it up. Uh oh, radiating uh -oh. depth charge. That. All right, maybe we should attack it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not attacking it isn't working. So. <laughs> you know, if attacking it works at, at least ninety-five percent of the time. But there, there definitely are some bosses in this game where not attacking it works better. <laughs> uh oh, depth charges. Maybe we'll get to see some overdrives. Yes. Oh shit. That doesn't look good. Oh, yeah, that, that hurt quite a bit. Ow, Ouch. Alright! Use a happy little high potion! Woo! <laughs> you just like channeling your inner Bob Ross, sir? <laughs> of course, yes. Because <laughs> <laughs> Bob Ross makes everything better. Uh, you know, I can't argue with that. Mm -hmm. The extractor. The extractor! Okay, it's... The extractor, yeah. You know, just kind of sitting there uselessly. <laughs> like, I'm in a bubble! I'm in a bubble! Oh crap, he's blinded. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Alright. Where's your... Where's your eye drops? Oh yeah. god, we're underwater! The eye <laughs> drops, they do not <laughs> I'm trying to figure out if that was McBain or Woody Allen. <laughs> there was like a cross between a stereotypical Jewish guy and Borat. I, I don't know where I was Apparently. going. Apparently. <laughs> uh, Waka looks like he's about ready to die, which typically I'm okay with, but for the purposes of this fight... Yeah, I might want to heal him just so he can survive the yeah, depth charges. Half of your fighting force, so. Yep, alright. Hit him in the face. Actually, we've we almost got him. I think if T2 uses his uh, overdrive, we should be able to take him out. Which will be exciting. About as fun as a barrel of monkeys. Alright, so apparently if you hit this thing enough, it comes back down. Yeah, it's like, okay, I'll stop. Alright, let's don't like the death point, George? Let's, let's, uh, let's show Slice and Dice off, because we haven't done that yet. Come on, I can do it. Yes! Woo! Woo! Yeah, we got this. We got this dude. Putting the, the finishing touches in him. I guess I hope so. It would be kind of embarrassing if this, if this guy didn't die. But, overkill. oh, overkill. Yeah. Overkill means the bubble death. bursts and you just gets like crushed by the immune <laughs> crush. Yep, exactly. No. Well, there goes half the Albed's budget. Actually, who am I kidding? They spent most of their budget on those laser guns that did nothing to spend. I think they spent most of their budget painting these stupid fucking machines. Have you ever noticed how there isn't a single one that isn't painted in bright primary colors? Yeah. That's that's a lot of pain. Actually, I don't think it is in primary colors. Well, there's a couple of secondary ones there. Are you hurt? Are you? Your no, no, fucking hair just went right through your neck. He sounds like he's yodeling when he speaks. <laughs> is everybody okay? Everybody okay? Well, you know, that's that's how he deals with the crisis. You're just sitting there yodeling. I wonder if he gets nervous enough, does his... Does his... Uh, accent become just, like, so ridiculous nobody can understand him? Mm-hmm. I can see it. There needs to be a side game based off of him. It would have been better than a... No, they're not! What is it with you and Blitzball? You're trying to save the fucking world! <laughs> the man has no priorities. Well, he does have priorities. They're, they're just wrong ones. Good job jumping to conclusions. Yep. That's what Waka's really good at. You almost said that in a cocky manner. 
He's like, no use complaining now. <laughs> yep, once again, Titus is making up for Waka's mess, which yeah. tells you just how pathetic Waka really is. When, when Tito becomes the voice of reason, you know that somebody is terribly, terribly that's wrong. That's the sad thing, though, is that outside of his whininess, he typically is. I know, and that's such a weird universe we're in. I don't remember that being that way, but... Uh, yeah, so now we're on the other shore, and everybody's crowding you know. You just got all the all the fanboys. Think, I, I believe there's a there's a primer around here actually. Oh, there it is, right up here. Woo! We learned that M is L. And now we're the main Han. Again, these are fuck that beans. Oh, these are all Hindu ranks, I think. Oh, I didn't know the the uh, shoe puff had a like, curly nose or whatever. Oh yes, are you gonna give me more shit? Oh man. All right, let's see what you got, Owaka. Uh, nothing good, actually. You know what? I'm gonna get more of these. About oh, 48 should do. Yeah, Didn't but you, you just used an eye drop. Hmm? You just used an eye drop. Oh. Yeah, but you should replace that one eye drop. The thing is, is that most of the time you can just use Asuna. So. But what if Yuna's in a bubble again? Guard you know, it's, I wouldn't put a pastor. <laughs> Guard Yuna, I'm going to stay here and look like a badass. <laughs> Whee! It's in took my daughter. Oh yeah, we're almost to Guado Salam. That place is fun. <laughs> That's, you know, Seymour's home turf. Whee! Alright, we'll be right, right back. We're just gonna save. Yeah, I still, I still remember. I have to. I have to remember. I have to keep this save because that's the one that is before the the tournament, so we can eventually show them winning. Hmm. Yep. I like it. All right, we're back. So, what does Kamari have to say? <laughs> kind of liked it better when he didn't say anything, but just because, like, you know, now he's all like, I fell as guardian. No, I don't want a whiny Kamari. Yeah. Mario just being like, mm, I am too good for words. It's much better. Hmm. Hmm. What I think you should do is become a, uh... You should th be a pastry chef. Pastry chef, yes. But you have to give me stuff. Oh, look, these, uh, the guados. They have really long arms. I have really long arms. What's wrong with really long arms? Yeah, but do you have, like, the weird claw things they do? Oh, well, no. <laughs> I don't think there's anything wrong with long arms. I would just, I would just make it a note but of that. But you're just, you're just bringing attention. To <laughs> I think that that's unfair of you, Benji. I'm triggered now. <laughs> it was a microaggression. It was, it was a microaggression. <laughs> All right, so now we're on the path to Guadalupe Salam, and oh God, no! This part makes me no, sad. No, no! <laughs> oh, wow! Why did she hedge the only person more annoying than Waka? <laughs> Guess who, viewers? And this is the, like, mildly pornographic part of the game. <laughs> okay, she looks mildly Asian now, but... <laughs> uh, a little... <laughs> A little winded, yeah. It's like going up to a cancer patient and be like, hey, hey, how you been? This is like watching two five-year-olds. Seriously. No, five-year-olds are cute. They're just fucking obnoxious. Wait, but do 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 Speaking of five year olds, you 
I, I kind of feel like Orin's the babysitter in this scenario. Nah, uh, you already screwed that one up, Tudu. <laughs> I mean, what other words sound like Al Bed in this universe? There's no Alibaba. <laughs> you look a little Al Bed there, Riku. She thinks she is. Like she's like I'm. Like I, I'm one of the girls now. I just arrived on a fucking swamp and I just kidnapped Yuna. But no, I'm one of you. God, these fucking people. These fucking writers. I know. <laughs> They're not kittens. You can't just collect them. Yeah, exactly. And by the way, she just kidnapped you, Yuna. <laughs> oh, okay. Open your eyes. Ah, they got whirly eyes. <laughs> you know, it'd be kind of nice if uh, Warren just slapped her, like right now. Like, open your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Orn, you're supposed to say, this is a really terrible idea. <laughs> oh, Waka, you're hilarious. <laughs> yep. In all the wrong ways. It was strange. Even though Waka had always hated the Alpha. Yeah. Shut the fuck up. I never realized Riku was one of them. I think he was probably too busy looking at her ass. No, no, no. He's got a thing for Lulu. Oh, yeah. I, I, figured he had, I figured he had a thing for Tidu. I mean, <laughs> yeah, seriously. Yeah, there was that one. <laughs> 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 oh. oh. It's a tutorial battle, guys. <laughs> Don't let her near the treasure chest. Is she, like, beatboxing right now? Like Apparently. Well, her hand isn't anywhere near her face, I guess, but... Mm -hmm. She yeah, looks she, like she's about to start. Yeah, she's stuck in the early 90s, I guess. Oh, yeah, so you get you get random treasure chests to show up, guys. So guess what you do? You steal them, and you get to collect them. And you get to use bomb cores, which, you know, if you feel like using Riku can be useful. So, uh-huh. <laughs> I mean, oh, no. Yeah. That's scary and annoying. <laughs> Alright, so mixing is actually a pretty useful skill in this game. It's the only real uh, asset to Riku. Is that you can mix items together and you get some pretty crazy shit. Um, later on, there's an ability called Triple uh, Nine. I think if you mix uh, two things together, it gets pretty nuts. So you mix two bomb cores together, and you have a firestorm, which is pretty... Yeah, that, that hurts a lot. But the thing is, you know, you're probably not going to be using Riku enough where you're going to be using this. Unless you want to use Riku, but why the hell would you do that? What did you do? <laughs> 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 what, it, what would, yeah, the, what's with the this friggin... This would have been much better as, like, a cutscene. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Instead of making us go through it. Precisely. Yeah, I guess... You I could have actually made it look decent. Damn interactive tutorials. It'd be funny if there was, like, nothing in it. Because, because Riku it's all. like, you already took it! <laughs> Alright, guys, so we're in the woods heading to Guado Salam. Unfortunately, we have Riku with us. And she's not going to leave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, she's going to be around a long time. So what's going to happen next? Find out in the next episode of Let's Play Final, Final Fantasy X. This is the Benjinator. And I am Erikos. See you guys next time. Bye-bye!